We're hearing new details from Maryland Senator Chris Van Hollen on the stroke he suffered earlier this year. Van Hollen appeared on CBS Mornings to talk about his experience. and Quata shares what he learned and the warning to others who may be at risk. Nearly three months since 63 year old Senator Chris Van Hollen suffered a minor stroke. They said it was a good thing I, I came in because we can see some bleeding uh, in, in the brain. During a campaign speech in May, Van Hollen first appeared fine, but in this video, you can see him start to lean over on the podium to steady himself. I felt lightheaded. I had a pain in my neck. And my ears were popping a little bit like you're on an airplane. Doctors found a tear in a vein in the back of his head. After a week of hospitalization and rest at home, Van Hollen has been recovering and tells CBS News he's reevaluating his busy schedule. I think the lesson for all of us uh, is you got to look out for your health. Dr. Celine Gounder says demanding situations like what Van Hollen faces on the job regularly could take a toll. We do certainly see a link between stress and high blood pressure, whether you're getting enough sleep. She says it's all too common for people to ignore the warning signs, which for stroke include lack of balance, dizziness, vision problems, and slurred speech. Here in the U.S., it's now the fifth leading cause of death, with someone suffering from the life threatening medical. Medical emergency every 40 seconds. While Van Hollen survived, he now has his own warning for others. When you're feeling these strange symptoms, don't just brush them off, which we so often do. Amy Kawada for WJZ.